hi and welcome to this new vlog. Um, I thought that today I would just take you along a journey to our very first ever women in tech event organized by Forecast. Um, so yep, yeah, I'm just leaving a client right now. I've just spent the day here and I'm off to the office to meet up with uh, my colleagues. Uh, so let's go. Hello, I'm taking over this vlog uh, just for now because Karen uh, is driving. <laughs> Karen, how do you feel at this moment about the event? Because we're on our way to Digital Atelier. Oh, that's true. How are you feeling? I'm feeling really pretty cool. A bit like nervous, nervous, excited. I think that's really where I'm at right now. Um, the thing is, like, we've been working so hard for this event. Like, we've put so much like of our soul and our minds and our hearts into this that I'm just I just want to see it come to life and being fulfilled and sharing it with uh, with all the audience and the speakers so uh, let's just say that I'm nervous and excited <laughs> what about you Lisbeth? well I'm feeling the same <laughs> also a bit stressed but excited so uh... Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's All right. It. So I am here with Mr. Jeremy Bonneval. He is one of uh, the founders of Forecast, and I just wanted to get his insights of, uh, yeah, what he thinks about the initiative. Uh, many, maybe a message that you want to share with the, the ladies coming tonight. Yeah, I think it's a great initiative because we have way too uh, few women in uh, in technology, and they do have a. Uh, a great addition to the team, they have different insights than others do, and that men do at least. Um, like care and change management is also going to be a very important part in technology. It's not only about implementing the technology, but also making it stick within the organization. So I think women have a great, great future in this uh, in this sector. So I think it's a great initiative. I wish you good luck tonight. Awesome, thank you. Okay, so I have here with me one of our speakers. So we have Wendy Myers. Hello. And I have a little question for you, Wendy, actually. Uh, if there's one thing that you would like your uh, the audience to remember, what would it be? Dare to jump. Dare to take a challenge and a risk, even if it's out of your comfort zone. That's what I would like them to remember. Wow, remember that, ladies. Valuable, valuable uh, advice. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so second uh, speaker that I have here with me, and that is Sana Verleven. She is the young ICT lady of 2019. Yeah. So congratulations. Thank you. Same question to you. I think actually there's two things uh, they should remember from tonight. I think first of all, this is really the time that we should invest in ourselves and upskill ourselves and invest in our technical skills as well as our soft skills. And the second thing is dare to speak out your ambitions. Nobody knows what you're dream path for your career. Sorry, that's what the ambitions are. Yeah, and nobody no, will tell me. Yeah, so indeed. really dare to step up and dare to speak out to your ambitions. Oh, <laughs> wow, lovely. Well done. Thank you so much. All right, ladies, remember that. <laughs> really, remember. Thank you so much, Katia. Okay. Right, so we have our fourth speaker here, Sophie. Um, Sophie, 
if you would like uh, your audience to remember one thing, it's a never stop learning thing. Never, never, never stop, stop learning. learning. Always. Never get old. Never be yeah. huh? Yeah, that's how you know you don't age. You exactly. Right? Yeah. Thanks. That was really lovely. How was the event? It was marvelous. Yeah. It was very inspiring. Even for me, it was inspiring. <laughs> Listening to everybody, and I think we need to be more involved in it. I agree. It was very nice. I agree. Empowering each other. That's where exactly. it starts.